I am just going to quickly record this video. Uh, this is a video in respect to the injury I have on the left foot. Uh, it is something that Slovenian police started to work on diligently together with the physician here next door, Igor Kotar, and then other physicians as well in 1995. And so they created like a masterpiece uh, for which a Chinese started to insist me that they were first. They started to insist me sometimes in 2005 that it's the, the, the pain in the foot is all connected to liver, kidney issues, that kind of stuff. Yeah, it all depends on where you have pain on your foot. Uh, that goes to Xi Jinping. Actually, even 2002, I would go. Yeah, they already caused so much damage by 2002 that Chinese started to tutor me uh, on how I'm going to know what exactly is wrong with my foot. Chinese were very, very angry at that time. Uh, and, you know, they gave this uh, necessary to Slovenian brutality a good, good, good platform for additional abuse, yeah? Uh, and the next one that came, that it was a Chinese traditional uh, healing, that they know how to naturally heal and stuff like this. Now, I don't know how this would appeal to any one of you, that somebody would go and basically stab you in your food so they could teach you basically how the Chinese traditional uh, healing, how all that Mr. Xi Jinping, you owe a good explanation about this stuff. Um, you had your people insist me that this is how it's going to be and so on and so forth. Uh, you gave a good platform to Slovenian police for that. The next one who started to support this was government of Angela Merkel. It was directly from Schwartz, from Joachim Schwartz, a German, now German chancellor. Uh, plenty Germans started to support this kind of toxic, <laughs> insane. Uh, I'm not going to say meddling into genocide. But to make things even worse, to make things even more, uh, to, to basically give Slovenian police support, to, uh, to give them like a full support, so they, they would have like a full confidence in butchery, so that they wouldn't have anything to fear. They demanded that Slovenian police, uh, beginning like 2004, they, they, in 2002, they, the Germans immediately jumped in and they started to support the Chinese claims and so on, which probably Germans hired Chinese for the dirty job. They did so for so many occasions. Um, an individual, I'm going to stop here, I'm going to just give you an example. The job of local psychiatrist Peter Kapsch and the police officers who escorted was to literally make evidence, whatever the police was, of the people that, that were involved in it. And if they would come across somebody that looks like somebody from the neighbors here that were heavily involved in crime against me, let's say, uh, like, let's say Alish Berger that is right next door here, yeah. Uh, a few days ago, I met an individual who is like his replica. It's like a duplicate. It's like you would mistaken one. His own brother would mistaken one. Uh, not only facially wise, but also expression wise, because it's like stuttering, uh, 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 completely the same voice, absolutely everything. Maybe a slightly uh, height issue, but everything else like totally, totally identical. Facially, everything identical. As soon as they would get person like this, even if the person have a different 
idea. As a matter of fact, doesn't even have any kind of idea about what the fuck is going on. The only thing they would do is they would have an individual like this approach him that was already completely under, not under control. This other, the Berger family was like a principal family, a principal criminals that ran this genocide. These are like more crazy than Milan Kuchan, if that tells you anything, people. This is this is this goes beyond insane. I mean, Milan Kuchan is as insane as he gets, but this shit goes crazier. It runs deeper. The only thing that will happen is they would approach the individual like this guy did, and they would start to tutor one how to uh, in this case, based on what I have seen, tutored one on how can I say it? the guy had like like from a backpack. This is all one day, it's all one fucking day. You go out, you are basically here. They storm you with issues involved in MPL. You will have like this in his hands, like this, uh, not this thing here, but like from belt, like, and was talking to me about the, the top prison where he got a job. Interesting enough, he just got a job over there, but he was the one Slovenian state had used previously, beginning like 15 years ago for transport, literally, into the prison dob, not too far from here. Um, a prison dob was already on the picture with the Milan Kuchan, with the Miroslav Berger, father of Alesh, and so on, uh, already in 1994. Uh, but, uh, you know, and, and laughing and looking at me and uh, that we don't know each other and this and that. Uh, and everything he uh, basically introduced through MK Ultra, everything was a fucking lie. Not that you couldn't identify one, but he would have you recall the events. But yeah, if you would go and check his resume, you would not get a proof that he actually works for a company which is supplying prison uh, with necessary material for assembly of some uh, fire um, Components that are being sold and so on. So they 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 have prisoners work, uh, basically, uh, the company where he got a job and so on and so forth. So that's how that he goes on. He just got one a year ago that kind of job and stuff. Uh, and so I am I am extremely extremely disgusted with the Germans. Uh, I think what. Chinese, Chinese, Chinese at the time did not know anything about what the fuck went on. Chinese, Chinese at the time when it all started did not understood anything about what the fuck went on. Chinese when it all started had no fucking idea about who the fuck I was, what the fuck I was. Uh, they were certain that they came across uh, <laughs> ultimate evil. <laughs> Uh, that you possibly can, and that I have plan on, uh, I don't know, damaging China or something like this, uh, the way they have, uh, the way this stuff was done, from my end, you couldn't figure out who the fuck I was if you were Chinese, because uh, as much as I didn't have any kind of hostility, exactly the opposite for Chinese, I started to uh, during MK Ultra, I was very, very oftentimes I was hostile to them uh, because of issues involving communism, and it's got to do with Americans, British, British. For the British, China was a no-no. Basically, even that they were doing business all the time. The same, the same thing was with the Germans. They wanted me to hate and hate. Everybody hates and get in the fight with absolutely everything and everybody, whoever would come across. And that's all it was. That's basically how it all functioned, you know? Uh, but it's interesting how the Germans rushed to the rescue and demanded from me, supporting that, yes, I'm going to demonstrate you this stuff. 
Uh, it is, in fact, the Chinese traditional medicine that they are able to determine, based on your foot injury, a pain, I should say, in the kind of issues, what exactly is going on uh, with uh, your liver, with your kidney, and this and that, and so on and so forth. Uh, and this is a fucking nightmare. For me, this was a fucking nightmare. I don't know anything. If 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 you would be if you would be training and you you would be doing a sports and stuff like this guy here, let's say, and you would be doing something like this. You would be healthy like an oak. And let's say let's just suppose Sonny, that, listen, I'm Jack Dempsey. There's no one like my Let's just suppose that you are this guy right there or one of the top sportsmen. How would you like to see a Chinese guy, let's say? as it was the case with the Xi Jinping, and this goes way before 2002, uh, telling you that you're going to be using a Chinese traditional medicine uh, to heal yourself uh, due to the injuries you have, which you, don't, you know very good, you don't have any and stuff, uh, but that this is the way it's going to be, and 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 it's going to be. Right. Well, the Germans gave instructions to Slovenian police in front of me. When I say instructions, Slovenian police didn't need any instructions to murder, to kill. It's totally disappointing, therefore, uh, for me to notice that government of Angela Merkel and uh, Joachim Scholz, and this is uh, so much, you see this stuff here, hard a kidney and so on kidneys this is really true kidney and liver this stuff is true i i was told that what's going to happen is you're going to learn uh, you must torture him until he develops the breach between this was a german order between what you see here and kidneys and liver and so on you must, you will use a Chinese a traditional. Jawohl, you will. So my question really to Angela Merkel and to Joachim Scholz and to the German politicians involved in this stuff, was it this like really, really, really necessary? Is Was it like necessary because Chinese uh, stated something like this and all the problems that you made? Uh, is it like you go in a, in a store and you just buy whatever the fuck you want? You get somebody killed, uh, you throw a few dollars on the table and you get somebody butchered and uh, is all is good, is no problems and so on. How are we going to fix this stuff? I know that the German government is in no hurry to have this stuff fixed. Maybe this is what it explains why the German government is in no hurry. What's in it for you to do this stuff like this to people? I mean, you were my allies, right? Weren't you my allies? You were my friends. You gave me a, a advice to eat cinnamon. Yeah, you must eat cinnamon. And you must, I don't know what the fuck you need. Uh, turmeric and all these doctors from your USA, America, and all this. What, what the fuck was this all about? I mean, we're going to summarize how much fault guilt bears who yeah we're gonna summarize we're gonna wrap this and i just want you to know the part that germany playing germany played in this genocide against me uh, so this is kind of europa you know this is not a toto cotonio you know europa you know, this doesn't work for me, shit like this. It doesn't work, this kind of stuff, yeah? You, you understand? Do you remember the stuff that you spoke with, the, with police in front of me? What you guaranteed me? You were actually shaking in anger in front of me. You were stressing the issues. Ah, you will see, you will see, you will see. Oh, fucking right did you have to hijack me? See, I hijacked me, abducted me to Slovenia. What right did you have to support this kind of stuff in other political options and 
and so what were you trying your 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 uh, European views to promote them in a such a way? Why? Why did you do this stuff? This is an open question to the Germany. Why was this stuff necessary? Obviously that you are swines. Obviously that we are swines. Obviously they are fucking pigs, not Europeans. This was recorded on a May 12, 2023, and uh, this is just a supplementary video which I have dedicated to the German family from what is the Grandbaum, I don't, I don't know, southern part of Switzerland that visited with the Bentley. The son who inherited the factory told me, I think he's got actually two sons, at least two daughters, one son, definitely. The biggest factory should be in that rayon, in that region, in that canton. Uh, that's all I have to do. And then I can tell you, you this was the guy. Have I identified him in this wealthy German Deutsche people that go uh, to the Baden and uh, they go for the massage and uh, all this traditional Chinese and it is this all this fantastic stuff. It's like this necessary actually to butcher people like this. Like this is like that's how you make money. That's how with the Germans. This is this is this is Gesellschaft with the Germany. This is how you do the business with it. That's how that's that's gonna be Europa. Eh? We're gonna be all fucking mentally sick, ill, and physically destroyed. Yeah, that's just Europa. We're gonna follow your example, uh, and uh, we're gonna be yeah, Polska, yeah, Czeska, yeah, Slovakia, Slovenia, Croatia, and then you're gonna go from the end. And go to be selling tanks to the Russians, and then when the fire burns all our countries, you're gonna be fucking selling us your services and your weapons and stuff, and you're gonna again climb back to the Reich like the one it was destroyed 80 years ago. This is the way, creating problems everywhere so the world doesn't see you, world on fire. You sell here, you sell there, a little bit here. World forgets about what even happened 80 years ago, right? With a little news like this, who the fuck will know? Thanks for watching this video.